Hey Cougars, I'm Joe and this is the Cougar Campus News. The HMBHS Spring Musical, Disney's Little Mermaid, opens tonight and runs for two weekends. Showtimes are 7 p.m. Fridays and Saturdays and 2 p.m. on Sunday. Student tickets are $10 and reserved seating can be purchased online or at the door. We hope to see you all at the show. And now, here's Alondra and me with a special announcement from leadership. Attention students, Spirit Week is coming up. Spirit Week will be from March 19th to the 23rd. Hey Alondra, what are the themes this year? Good question, Joe. The overall theme is versus. Each day will have two opposing themes and the 9th and 10th graders will compete against the 11th and 12th graders. Monday will kick off with rainy versus sunny. Underclassmen will dress up for rainy and upperclassmen will dress up as sunny day. On Tuesday, it's the 2000s versus the 1990s. Underclassmen will be dressing up from the 2000s and upperclassmen will be dressing up from the 90s. Wednesday is tourists versus locals with the underclassmen representing tourists and the upperclassmen representing the locals. Thursday brings the battle of the bands with underclassmen as rockers and upperclassmen as rappers. Friday will be your class colors. Wait, what are the class colors? Good question, again. Freshmen will be yellow, sophomores are pink, juniors are green, and finally seniors are purple. What if I need help dressing up? Good question. Leadership has put up flyers all around campus with a few ideas on how to dress up for each day of Spirit Week. And don't forget to check out the action in the quad each day next week as classes compete for Spirit Week points. See your class officers if you want to participate. Seniors, buy your senior picnic ticket for Great America. Ticket prices increase on March 29th. See Ms. Acosta or class officers for more information. And now here's Mr. Nazar with his weekly report. Good morning. Once again, I think it's important that I really recognize every student for how they participated and behave during the uh, student stand-up and statement against deadly school violence in schools. I was so impressed with the thoughtfulness, the recognition, and respect. I admire our student body so greatly that we can think about others and be compassionate and thoughtful and caring. What happened there was tragic. And none of us want this to ever happen again. The mere thought of even losing one student from our student population would be devastating to me and to all of us. We need to stay vigilant, report if we think things are not going right with a friend or a student or if you heard a rumor. We have a new tip line called Tip 411 coming online. We have student advocates who are there to step up. So a lot of us are very involved and interested in the safety of all of us. But we all need to work together to make sure that this is a safe environment, and I believe it will. A um, couple other things. Spirit Week is coming up next week. I would uh, ask all of you to participate in this very fun activity. It's one of the great events during the school year. Uh, you'll have different activities at break time and dress-up days and uh, culmination in a big assembly. And finally, uh, starting tonight is a two-week run of the student musical, uh, The Little Mermaid. Come out, support your friends, support your classmates, and be entertained by a tremendous production. For all of us, let's work hard. Let's be kind to one another. Have a great day. On March 22nd, we are taking a guided campus tour for UC Santa Cruz. We will learn more about the different programs at UC Santa Cruz that UC Santa Cruz has to offer, their school culture, and answers to questions you may have about their campus. This will be an all-day event, so students will be missing first through seventh period. Permission slips on first-come, first-served basis, and juniors get priority. This trip will fill up quickly. Please turn in your permission slips to your counselor as soon as possible. Past two days of Wellness Week have been action-packed. Wednesday, students made stress balls 
and yesterday it was nap time. Here is some footage. <laughs> We're going to be um, painting rocks and we're also building stress balls. With the stress ball, you fill it with beads and then pour it into the balloon. And that makes a nice ball that you can just squeeze, get your anger out, release tension, you know? And then the rocks, it's... Just gotta paint some rocks, man. I don't know what, what else is there to say. It's a good way to release stress in a you know, stressful environment. Keep us going through the school year. Finish very, out strong. Very good for the soul. Yesterday, me and Everett did yoga, and that was like clearing our chakras and yeah. enhancing our auras. And today, we're painting rocks. Keeping it going. De stressing. Yes. Wellness, Wellness week. Wellness week. We yeah. Break mine because I have nails. <laughs> <laughs> It's time to get ready for lunch, Cougars. Here's what's on the lunch menu. Cheese pizza and pepperoni pizza. Do you have an interest in creative write or art? Writing Club is accepting submissions for this year's Muse. Short stories, poems, photographs, paintings, and more are accepted. Email Mr. Mullen for more details. Early release. Please excuse the varsity and JV swim team at 145. Now here's Mr. Olson with the daily trivia. Happy Friday out there, Half Moon Bay High School. The answer to our question yesterday was our very own Maddie Arnold. Yes, she's the uh, student director of The Little Mermaid, which opens tonight. We offer our congratulations to Mr. Westwood and his class. They were the fastest dancer. And since tonight is the grand opening of The Little Mermaid, we're going to have yet one more trivia question sent in from Mr. Ward about Little Mermaid. Enjoy the show tonight and have a great Friday at Moon Bay High School.